When Group Captain Shubhanshu Shukla launches aboard SpaceX rocket on his maiden journey to the International Space Station, he'll carry a small souvenir. A surprise that he wants to personally hand it over to Rakesh Sharma once he returns to Earth after completing his 14-day mission at the International Space Station. As the first Indian to travel to space in the year 1984, Wing Commander Rakesh Sharma has inspired generations of Indians to look up at the stars and dare to chase their dreams. But for Shukla, he has been like a mentor. A fellow test pilot in the Indian Air Force who has been guiding him throughout his journey. Now, with just a few days remaining before the mission's scheduled launch from Florida, the four astronauts, one from the United States of America, India, Hungary and Poland, are currently in quarantine, undergoing their final preparations. Now, the mission is now scheduled to launch on June 10th at 5.52 p.m. Indian Standard Time from the NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Florida. Now, if you remember, almost 40 years ago, that historic flight in 1984 clearly marked a pivotal shift in India's space journey. Group Captain Shukla was born a year later, in 1985, and grew up being deeply inspired by the stories he read about the mission in textbooks. But since India did not have an active human space flight program, he said that there was no way for him to become an astronaut. But what certainly fascinated him were fighter jets. So when the opportunity arose in, in the year 2018 through Gaganyaan, he said he just applied instinctively. Also one of the four astronaut designates for Gaganyaan, India's first ever human space flight, Shukla has undergone rigorous training over the past one year for his first space flight, Axiom Mission 4. During the upcoming 14-day stay in orbit, he'll also conduct seven experiments shortlisted by ISRO, investigating the effect of microgravity on various cultures from stem cells to crop seeds. Now, the experienced Air Force test pilot will also carry mango nectar, gajar ka halwa and moong dal halwa, a nostalgic taste of home in the space orbit. He'll also carry symbols and souvenirs crafted by the students from National Institute of Design celebrating India's culture, artifacts which represent the spirit of India in space. From space, he'll also be speaking live to students, educators and members of India's growing space industry through several interactive sessions. And he says, I just want to tell everyone that space is no longer a distant dream, but it's a future that they can share. But what Shukla is most excited about is his traveler's number, a historic serial number marking an astronaut spot in the human space exploration. Now, the crew on Tuesday also introduced their new mascot, plush baby swan named Joy, which will act as a zero-gravity indicator for the crew, a physical confirmation that they have transitioned to microgravity. Now, the mascot was chosen for its deep cultural meaning, wisdom and purity in India, resilience and loyalty in Poland, and natural beauty and devotion in Hungary. Now, having extensively trained over the past one year, Group Captain Shukla said that he's now very confident, not just in his own abilities, but in the entire team's capacity to execute this Axiom Mission 4 successfully.